Okay. Here we have the gravity application for the Nokia Pi 800. Gravity is the Twitter app built by mobilewaze.de. It's not free. It's priced at $10. But we think this is a great app for Twitter users. And probably Nokia Pi 800 users who want to update their Twitter status and see what their friends are talking and all that stuff. So let's get into the app. So this is the home screen of the app. So right now the application is running in demo mode and there's a free trial download available from mobilebase.de. You can try it for 10 days for free and after the end of the trial you can purchase the application. I'm sure you'll uh, love the features of the application. So this the home screen. So this shows the photos of all my con like followers or folks I'm following based on the uh, last updated time of your status so it's pretty cool eight people uh, like a senior so with their icons or display images or avatars so you can basically get into this account and uh, see the tweets you can also like search twitter right from here in this case let's want to search something Let's add a search term. Let's say want to search for phone arena. This is a tweet deck. Might appreciate this feature because tweet deck uh, supports you to saved search items and you don't have to keep searching again it just updates that specific particular section automatically I'm not sure if dwell has such a feature i'm talking about the desktop clients but this looks pretty much like a desktop client see the ui is like pretty good and very usable and the colors are pretty nice on the eyes so see the last uh, searches as shown here let's try to add one more search term so shows a Twitter trends here which is pretty interesting so these are the most talked uh, most tweeted terms right now so April Fools which is coming tomorrow and AT&T, Chicago Sun Times G20, Conflict or all these stuff so it's pretty good this app the screen so you can save a search term and I'm not sure if you can add another search. Let's try that. Let's uh, add a search term for Nokia. And cool. So you can add up uh, two searches. I don't know if you can do more. So you can just add your favorite stuff here and keep tracking them here. Wow, this is awesome. So right from your home screen, you see. Uh, The, uh, your Twitter search results and here are the images in my phone so basically I can uh, upload stuff right from here basically tweet picking so let me try to upload this so this is Apple and let's post this this basically uses tweet pick to upload a picture so it says tweet picking So there's this neat uh, progress indicator at the bottom, notification section. Not much intrusive, so it says pictures posted. So let's see if the picture has actually been posted. So let's get into our tweet, our Twitter account. So this is our Twitter account, Phone Arena. So you can follow us at twitter.com slash phone arena. So it's not yet. Uh, update it so let's try to update now just checking for new tweets there's a lot of work gone into the uh, bandwidth usage in the application so if you're on a GPRS connection or if you're on a Wi-Fi you don't have to bother much about the 
transfer data transfer but if you're on a gps connection and if you're going to be paying per uh, kb so this app is pretty good in that in handling data doesn't uh, gives you even the feature to turn off images and uh, you see a progress or uh, data indicator data usage indicator at the home screen let's i'll show it to you sometime and uh, so i'm going to like hit this picture page so we uploaded a picture to Twitpic right from the app. So let's see if the picture has actually gone through. So it's it's a pretty big file, I guess. Wow, this is nice. So right from the application I can post pictures this was when I took at a MacBook showroom local MacBook showroom so it's pretty good so you can just close the app and why I love Nokia compared to the iPhone is that Nokia supports multitasking once I open Safari the app dies and on iPhone but Nokia Fire Blizzard it doesn't happen so so there's already a reply from Mickey regarding that uh, retweet and uh, let's reply to him saying uh, okay HD video demo oops video demo Of gravity is coming. Oops, this keypad needs a lot of work in the Nokia Fire Double Zero. Still not very comfortable with it. So, uh, send a tweet. So, it's sending the reply. So, the Twitter posts of other users are up, of your followers are updated randomly around in a particular time interval. So, here yeah, is that you can add multiple accounts. So, here's the this is what I was talking about. So, it shows you the uh, data usage so far so I've used about uh, 466 KB on my in this session so you can even add in Laconic account is it with a competitor so let's look so these are something some application centric screens so you can also go offline and let's disable images and see how it goes so so you're going to be saving a lot of uh, bandwidth so here it is so go to mobilewaste.d and download the Twitter app called Gravity and I'm sure you'll love to use it on your uh, Nokia 5800 or in case you have a 60 phone so you have it even available for the uh, Nokia E71 let's try it there full screen uh, app so there's a QWERTY keyboard on this device which makes it much more special so, so the same account I have signed in already on the E71 and uh, let's tweet something from here let's go online 